do you think that the dynamics between men and women would be really screwed up and that you would be in the, the kind of the worst end of that, I think, Definitely. is what he's getting yep. at. That's Definitely. disgusting. Yep. <laughs> Here, let's get all the answers. Go ahead. Yeah, that, that was about three seconds to the microphone, but go ahead. Sorry, what did you say? What am I talking about? Do you, is the TikTok brain, do you need a little energy drink or what's... It, you know, can we save the low tier trolling for halfway through the show? Can Wait, we save it to what we get like halfway through? Because I mean, we just got started. You're already trolling. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think we're talking about? I don't know. I wasn't listening. When, I don't listen when what? it's not my turn. Do you know what I mean? But it was about to be your turn. The TTS came in asking about what? I don't know. It's like the teacher putting on the fucking student <laughs> on. Okay. Uh, Is it coming to you? No. You just weren't, you didn't even listen to what any of the other girls were talking about. You didn't hear oh, the TTS. Yeah, to that. Andrew even restated the question in a better, like an easier way for you to answer it. Uh, what, were you, what, were you thinking about, what were you thinking about when you were not listening to what all these girls said? How Andrew long are we going to be here for? That's really what you were thinking about? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we're only an hour into the show. I was thinking about how hungry I am. Why would you have not eaten before? I did. I eat a lot. You were thinking about how hungry... Here, like, can you just verbalize your thoughts? I'm just curious. Uh, I'm hungry. Yeah. Uh, TikTok. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm hungry. I was literally, TikTok. You're literally spot on. Yeah. Yeah. And I don't listen to Andrew. He's irrelevant. I don't even know who he is. You're coming in bad faith already? That's okay. What? I don't know why. Because of yesterday. What happened? He's just rude. Anyways, next question. <laughs> All right, your answer to the AI thing. Me? If, I'm just letting you know, if, you, if we have to repeat one more question to you and you're not listening, I'm just gonna kick you off the show, okay? I'm Deal? Glad. I wouldn't care. Don't, you wouldn't care? Don't care? No, not really. You do, re you requested to be on the show. Yeah, yeah. and then we weren't gonna come today, and then you said mm. you got no one to replace us with, so then we came. No, that was her who wasn't gonna come today. You were. Yeah, but let's be real, if she wasn't gonna come today, do you think I was? That's not what she yeah, said. Yeah, well, why would he assume differently? <laughs> Okay, I didn't listen to one question. Why is it such a big deal? Well, because what it does, it derails the show. And, and so, uh, unfortunately, if you, if you derail the show and we have to get into repeating everything, it kind of breaks up the speed of the conversation. <clears throat> so the point of the show is that you're here to have a conversation on dating and interpersonal dynamics between people. And so we, we do expect that people come on the show, participate in the show. That seems reasonable. Okay. I don't think okay is a sufficient okay, answer. Okay, well, if you would like, you can repeat and I will answer. What? Like, whatever the question was that he was asking me. Uh, okay. Can I repeat for her? Go ahead. I, Are you threatened by AI replacing women? AI, oh. arti artificial girlfriends. Are you threatened that uh, you mm. will not have a possibility of the true connection and relationship? I mean, no. No? No. And there is not much of a connection already going on, so... I mean. No. <laughs> <laughs> what about OnlyFans? What about AI OnlyFans accounts? Do you feel yeah. threatened by that? Um, because they could do anything, and exactly. they could be anyone. And yeah, better that than is us. true. That is true, but I haven't experienced it, so I'm not really too sure, but I am threatened by it, but once it comes about, then we'll see how I feel kind of thing. You know what I mean? Oh my God, I feel bad. Your answer to the question? <laughs> to the last question? No, I'm not threatened by that. No. No, if a man was interested in that, I would not be interested in him. I'd rather be alone, honestly. So I'm not threatened because I am married, but uh, single women <laughs> who are in this world should be threatened because uh, men already disconnecting completely. I mean, we're losing guys to the... <laughs> Completely. There, where it is very minimal investment and huge reward, and when AI comes in, and when it will, 
I, th I don't remember the full stats, but it's like crazy number. In just a matter of like few days or weeks, it's like well, millions okay. and millions me, downloads. Um, I was thinking about this the other night. Maybe let me let me try to follow up on this just briefly because I, I don't think that um, that women understand the totality of what's being asked here. So let's let's let me ask it this way. Let's pretend aliens came down from a different planet, okay? And all of them appeared to be extremely good-looking females, okay? And they were genetically close enough that men, if they had sex with them, could impregnate them. <laughs> and they came down <laughs> and they said, up. they said, listen, we're here for the male DNA, and there's just billions of us, and we need to be impregnated by And she men. doesn't argue. Okay? And hang, she doesn't. Hang, on, hang, on, let me, hang on, let me finish, please. Sorry. Let me finish. Okay? There's billions of us. We need to be impregnated by the men, and we're all, they're all beautiful in comparison to, like, the average female. Would you guys feel threatened then? Would you feel like, oh, shit, we have... Because there's no actual competition to this at all, right? So I think it's a matter of perspective. Exactly. No woman's ever seen any competition so other than other women. So I'm just wondering, if that dynamic existed, would you feel threatened then? No, because it's nothing we can do about it anyways. Just radical acceptance. They better than us. You know? There is something <laughs> women can do. Can I there say something? I don't think that women just, the only competition in life is like other women. Like, let's not say that. Like, there's many things. Like, a lot of women don't even, my competition is not driven by other women. Yes, like, I obviously know that other guys find women attractive, and that's a thing, but I don't see it as, like, competition. Well, but, I mean, then who are you competing with? Men have to compete inside I'm of a higher with structure. Yeah, I know. Okay, but that's kind of a cop-out because you're a woman. <laughs> <laughs> At least so, I have that So you're saying, I don't have to compete with other women. I don't have to compete with women, but if you're competing with yourself, you're still competing with a woman. So I, I, I don't really even understand that, that cop-out, right? Men have to compete within a hierarchy, and women seem like they have to compete with other women for yep. the right kind of men. But I don't see where women have to compete with men. Can I say something about this? I think, uh, actually, it's, in Netflix, it's a Russian uh, TV show that all the AI women are like gorgeous and perfect, and I see it, and I'm fascinated. But I think if it actually happened, me personally, I won't feel threatened, not because I'm not threatened, because I'm too threatened, so I have <laughs> nothing to compete. I'll just give in, you know? Take them, and that's it. I cannot compete something that it's superior, you know? I feel like if they came out with like an AI woman, they'd also come out with an AI man. Likewise. So yeah, that's true. Now I now hang on. While I totally agree with that, um, that they would, in fact, try to satiate that market very, very quickly. Um, AI's AI men aren't going to provide resources, yep. and it seems that the distinction here between men and oh. women is that often women are going for men who provide resources. Men are not going for women to provide them with resources. They don't give provide a shit if women have resources yeah, or not. Completely. They don't care if you're the hot chick at the Taco Bell or the hot chick who's the CEO of the company. They like both equally, True. right? They think exactly. both of them are equally Andrew. worthy of carrying their baby. 